Yes, the, you just made the claim that we stole, uh, we took scriptures which are not ours. Sure, you do not. Okay, tell me then, what Israel mean? Israel? Yeah. Uh, the name, the meaning of yeah. the word. No, oh, no, don't tell me first the meaning. Tell me first who is he. If I say to you right now, there's a guy in the Quran, the Quran keeps saying more than 40 times, keeps saying Israel, Israel, Israel. If I ask you who is Israel, who is Israel? Israel means to fight with God, to, to the fight with God, yes. Israel means the fight with God, right, right. Yeah. Are, are you listening too much to Muhammad Hijab? Uh, no. <laughs> it means to struggle, fight with God. Ah, okay, that's that's different. That's that, that's better now. Struggle with God. Ah, okay. Yeah. So how does how this name came to exist? Who is Israel? He was the um, something to do with Jacob. I can't remember it. Mm. How do you know it's about Jacob? What do you learn that from the Christians, from the Jews? It's thing. It's written in the Jewish. Mm. Jewish, so uh, how you Muslims you say the Quran is the book of Allah, but the book and the, this is the only book you can follow Yet you cannot find in the book of Allah. Who is this guy? His name is Israel Because we believe that Jews and Christians are people of the book doesn't that's another question You have a book you have to follow your book is missing something very important if I say to you Oh sons of Obama and shouldn't I tell you first who is Obama? Yeah, I, it it does mention there. It is written. It is mentioned in the Quran. Where where it mentioned in the Quran? Who is who is Israel? Show me. Be my hero. The children of Israel are definitely. I know the children of Israel, but who is Israel? This is the question. Uh, the, it's somewhere in the Quran, I think. Where where? Uh. Then I'll search for it. Ah, okay, okay. I see, I see. Okay, forget about Israel. Isa, who is Isa? Isa, he's a prophet. Who is Isa? Who is he? Where he was located, where he lived. Uh, Israel, where he located, where he lived. Uh, Moses, where he located, where he lived. Uh, Abraham, where he located, where he lived. Who are those people? And what the language they speak? We, it, your scriptures have been passed on to us. What do you mean, Pastor? You, 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 you know, you Muslim, you deny our, uh, our, our, our Okay, hold on. So, are you saying to me you stole the names and you base your knowledge on what we have? What, what do you mean, stealing? What do you mean? I am asking you if we want to know who is this guy, his name is Isa, where we will know who is he, where he was located, which city he live in. Where he used, where he used to live, where, where we can find that. Here we go. Go sh show me from the Quran. Okay. Who is Isa? Uh, what in the world what? the word Isa mean? We do I not know. know. Okay. Know. So you do not know what Isa mean. You do not know where Isa lived. You do not know Isa. He spoke it's to just who? The name you do not, what do you mean? So you know. So what the point of speaking about the guy? You don't. You tell me nothing about him. Yeah, I don't, I don't know, but there's so other people. I don't know personally. I don't know, but there, there is other people would know. If you no, nobody knows. Know. No, not a single one of you knows. I challenge you. I challenge you to bring me a sheikh. He knows. Your God do not know. Your prophet do not know. Your scholars do not know. Your Zakir Naik do not know. All the gods of Islam do not know. Hmm. So, what kind of a book, you Muslim? You claim that this is a perfect book. The Quran is like a uh, like a uh, you know somebody he have like twenty books in the table and they are in papers, and then somebody opened the window from two sides and the wind came and take them out and mix all the papers together and now we make them book one book, well, and Isa then you don't understand what this guy is name. talking about. What? Well, the Isa is just the name for Jesus. Who is Isa? You need to tell me where this name is coming from. Nobody heard of him. Historian never heard of Isa. Arab Arabic Christian, Ar Ar no Arabic Christian. Never we are we are the Arab. We are the Christians. We never call him Isa. We never heard of Isa. Who is this guy, Isa? Well, that's you, Arab Christians. That doesn't mean we are the Arab. Here we go. Your prophet isn't he an Arab? He's talking to who? He's an Arab talking to the Arab. So he should learn from us the name. Where he come with the name Isa from? In Arabic, we call him Yeshua. In Hebrew, they call him Yeshua.
It's a Quranic original translation. What original translation? This is a translation. This it's is a Quranic. name. This is a name. Where is Isa coming from? You do not know. Yes. What is your point? And it's just my name. point is when you are a thief, you do not know what the names mean. You do not know where the name is coming from. For you are just a thief. If I steal something from somebody, and you ask me where you got this from. I have no answer because I am just a person who stole it. I did not make it. I am not the one who bring it. I have no connection with it. It is just a theft. Okay, what, what does Jesus mean? Okay, hold on. Hold on. If I ask you what Jibreel mean, the guy who broke your property, uh, Jibreel, what, what Jibreel mean? You mean he's the, uh, he's the, he was an angel. He was a first. Well, thank you very much. He's an angel, guys. He's an angel. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, but who is Jibreel? I don't look up the name. So here we go. Is it weird that your God, Allah, he speak Arabic and he, he favored the Arabic and Arabic is his favorite language? Even Adam, he said, Alhamdulillah, the first word he spoke. And then we find that Jibreel it's is not the, an Arabic word. It's, is, Jib, just, is Jibreel an Arabic Jibreel word? Is just hold on, hold on, Arabic. hold on, it's hold on. Is Adam, is Adam an Arabic word? No, no, no. Let me finish. Let is me, Adam an Arabic, Arabic word? Is, an, is Adam an Arabic word? Adam, no, no, okay, hold on. Why not? What do you mean? Why? Because first, uh, it's, it's Hebrew, it must be so. So, so okay, so hold on, guys. Adam is a Hebrew, I will go with you. Adam is a Hebrew, so why Adam is a Hebrew? Because the the scriptures was first given to Hebrews. What's uh, I saw Adam was a Hebrew from the beginning, he was born Hebrew, there was no Hebrew yet. No, the scripture, oh my god. The scripture in which don't say my oh my god so in my Allah show respect please now when you say to me Adam was a Hebrew Adam his name is I'm a Hebrew. He Hebrew so why Adam, Adam so why Adam when he sneezed he said Alhamdulillah in Arabic so his name is Hebrew but he speak Arabic no he said the equivalent of Alhamdulillah no he did not say the equivalent don't lie he said Alhamdulillah do you want me to show you the reference Yeah, he said Alhamdulillah. So what? Yeah, but Alhamdulillah is in Arabic. So how this guy? He's a he, his name in Hebrew, but he speak Arabic. The, the Islam is a stupid religion. Mm. Jibril uh, is Jibril is exist before the Arab people exist. Jibril is just Arabic for Gabriel. I don't know what your problem is. No, there's no. This is nothing. There's nothing. It's called Arabic, my friend. This is not Arabic. Jibril is not an Arabic. It is two words. Jibril. Oh. You see, it's the translation of Gabriel. What, what is Gabriel? Okay, guys, translate of Gabriel. <laughs> Abdul, if you if it's the same name, how you how this is can be a translation? Jibril, what Jibril mean? You Muslims, you copy names, and all the names approve one thing for us that those don't belong to the God of Islam. As an example, so okay, hold, so on, hold, on, your, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me ask you. Problem. Let me ask you. Hold on, Israel. Is it the true that the last letters two two letters in Israel? Are eel, which mean God? Ila, yeah, Ila, yeah. Okay, why in the whole religion of Islam we don't find eel? Ilaha, Ila. What Ilaha? Don't be stupid now. Eel is not Ilaha. Eel. No, so this guy, this guy, this guy, Isra, Isra, he belonged to God who is eel. Why in your language we cannot find eel? Where is eel? Those who don't belong to Allah, if this is if, if Israel, if he is a person belong to Allah, his name should be Israel. Allah, if Jibreel belong to Allah, he should not belong to Eel, he should belong to uh, Jibra Allah. If uh, if uh, if Ishmael belong to Allah, his name should not be Ishmael, his, his name should be Ishma Allah. So, where but, does Gabriel come from? Then? Because this is a, it's what we are saying, it's a theft. Your prophet is a thief, he stole the name, he do not know what You're they not mean. Saying Gabriel, Gabriel, what does it come from? It is Hebrew. <laughs> I know it's Hebrew, but if it is. It saying... is two words. It's two words. It is. All those names are not names. Those are a sentence. But you're a prophet because he's a fool. He is a thief. He do not know what they mean. So he stole the names, which is a sentence. It's a statement. Same as Abraham. Okay, how Abraham. Do you know the, how do you know the uh, Quran? Then uh, just translate it differently. Then what translate? What translate? What, just we are give, talking you, about the Arabic. Why, right? We are talking about the Arabic. Give it a completely different. We are language. not talking about translation. We are talking about the Arabic, Abdul. We are not talking about translation. And now, hold on, hold on. Allah have ninety nine names, right? Attributes, yes. Okay. What is the eel between them? 
We don't say Eid, we say Allah. So no, 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 no. Allah is a name. Allah is a name. Allah, it's a name. Where we can find Eid? Here we go. Isra, Eid. As you see, this is a word very important, appear by the names of every important figure in the Bible. So, even Jesus, they called him Emmanuel, which means God is with us. So, Israel, Ishmael, uh, uh, Mikael, Jibril. Uh, uh, why Eel is not one of the 99 names? Because Muhammad, he never thought about this. He never, he don't know. He thought those are one word name. But those are not names. Those are a statement. It's a statement. It is not a name. If I ask you now, what Abraham mean? Do you know? Abraham? Uh, no, I don't. Okay. Why Muhammad did not know, do not know he's a prophet of God? What would you mean Muhammad didn't know? He do not know. He do not know even why the name coming like, like even sometime he write the word Abraham as Ibrahim. Sometime he write it as Abraham because he's confused. He do not why know what is the correct it, why name. Why did he write it different? Show me. Okay, if I show you, you leave Islam. No, I don't. I don't. I don't know. Just so once know, he say Abraham, know. once he say he, once he say Abraham without Alif, and once he say Ibrahim, how he cannot even come with the correct name? I'm saying to you, if I find you Abraham, are you willing to leave Islam? First, you show me, then I'll make. Uh, I don't know. I don't think so. No, why? I don't. Know. Why you will not? Because if you so, why you are challenging me to show you if the point if there's no point? I just want to see if it's true or not. It's true. It. I never say anything. I don't say anything unless it's true. It's recorded. It's in the internet. People will make fun of me. And you know that okay so why your god he do not know and the one is talking there is your prophet not supposed to your god not your prophet sorry well, sorry what the one is saying that is your yeah. prophet or your god it is your god supposedly this is quran right mm -hmm, yeah so why once it come as ibrahim and one it's come as abraham I want to see that the, if it actually says Ibrahim and Abraham differently. I want to see that. But. Yeah, I know you want to see that, but nothing for free. You have to give me. <laughs> you have to give me a motivation so we can get you busted. Do you promise me? Do you promise me? This is BS, absolutely. All your religion is BS. Here we go. Okay, hold on, hold on. So Who is a Muslim? Hold on here. Who is a Muslim is willing to give me a call and he swear by Allah if I show him the Quran saying once Abraham, one Abra one Ibrahim, he will leave Islam. Who want to do that? We are being ridiculous now. I am not show? being ridiculous because you challenge me and I am here to challenge. I am here to show everybody that every Muslim Abdul is a stupid. You. I didn't say. No, you see, no, you are I'm challenging not. me. You said no. You said, so why you, oh, now you can't show it to me. And here, actually, I want to prove something. Corruption in the Quran. Because Ibrahim is the Arabic. What Ibrahim is Arabic? <laughs> I don't know. I don't, I'm not going to speak Arabic. I'm just assuming. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Ibrahim is the Arabic. What are you talking about? There's nothing called Arabic. Since when Ibrahim oh is, is, is Ibrahim an Arab man to be an Arabic, you idiot? It's like You're saying to me, Arabic. it's like saying to me, George is an Arabic. No, George is not because the name is, is so. What so English. what make Abraham Ibrahim make it an Arabic? What kind of cult this cult do not know what they are talking about because. Either his name oh, is Abraham. We are because, talking. We are it. talking about the same book. You cannot have the name written in the same book, one as Abraham and one as Abra Abraham, because okay, show me. because that will make it two different person. Show me where. Show me. Silence me, right? Yes. Show me. Okay. So if we show you in the Quran that it's appear as Ibrahim and as Abraham, if we show you it's Ibrahim and Abraham in the Quran, what are you willing to do? I am not willing to leave this. Why would I do? Uh, okay, get lost. Who is a Muslim willing to call me? And let us see if it's a bride.